All right, so this video is a holiday gift guide for all the creatives out there. If you're looking to shop for them or if you're looking to treat yourself, treat yourself to a little something, we're gonna be doing lower priced items all the way to the expensive stuff, which happens to, why is everything in the creative space so expensive? Anyways, let's get into it. Starting with our first item, which is Toss the Pig. I don't know. Now, these come as small dice, but the version I'm gonna show you here are the large version. Now you saw this originally in Peter's Dope Squad video. I also have uh, two pigs in my pocket. I like to keep this game in my camera bag or in my pocket because it's a great way to make friends and have some fun. This pig right here is literally a dice and it lands in different ways and it's worth different points. And if you pull these out of your pocket, not the big ones, but the small ones, people are like, why, why do you have pigs? It's so strange, you're weird. But then you explain the game and you play it and then they're like, wow, I love that you have this. So that is 10.99, put it in your camera bag, put it in your pocket, you're gonna make friends. I love it, favorite game on the planet. Toss the pigs. Woo, a snouter. Our next item comes in at 11.95. This is literally atmosphere in a can. You will make photographers and filmmakers so happy. For example, let's make this shot more moody. We'll recreate a scene from Lord of the Rings. Frodo, is that you? Where are you? Samwise, Samwise over here. We must get the ring back. We must get the ring. I'm Legolas. <laughs> See, wasn't that so believable because you had atmosphere spray? Wait, transition. Now we have to try to get rid of the atmosphere spray in here because we sprayed too much. All right, our next item coming in under $15 we have the Creative Quest by Questlove. This is one of my favorite books as a creative person. Basically, if you're looking to define your creative voice, this explores all of that and also kind of gives you some tips on how to be more creative. So I love this book, highly recommend it. If you wanna make any creative person happy, because there's a good chance that they drink coffee, just gift them a bag of coffee. $17.99, this is my favorite, 49th parallel. This is made in Vancouver, Canada. In my personal opinion, I try a lot of different coffee. This is the best. I don't know who came out of my mouth there. Moving to the under $50 category, we have this great filmmaking and photography tools. This is one of my favorite things to keep in my camera bag. This is the small rig camera tool. And the main reason why I love it is because when you're putting plates on cameras, you literally have a flat edge here, so you don't have to use a coin, and then you have all the other little hex keys, you got yourself a Phillips, you got all the tools that you need to put your camera on a tripod and just fix things on the spot. This is $30, they make a few variants of it so you can find one that you like, but it's actually very valuable. It adds a lot to my life and I highly recommend this $30, this tool. The next item is the Anchor IQ3. This is a fast charger. The reason why I bought this is because all my friends did sponsored videos for them and I bought it to wanna to support them and it's actually an amazing product. You can charge your phone three times faster and in a pinch you can actually charge your MacBook Pro. So if you forget like your charger at Starbucks because you like met up with another creative and they're like, we should collab one time and do like some sick Instagram posts together and you kept talking and you forgot your charger. Well, at least you can still charge your MacBook Pro and do the collab. And then you'll have to spend a day getting your charger back from Starbucks because you took the bus in anyway. All right, so moving on to this deck of cards that gives you photography tips and it is also a playing deck. So I found this project on Kickstarter originally and now the product is available on Amazon, but literally you have a normal playing card deck, but it actually gives you tips on how to be a better photographer, both technical and creative. So I think this is great if you have a photographer in your life and also you just wanna play with cards and learn something at the same time. All right, so this is one of my favorite books of all time and I can already see you rolling your eyes because you're like, there, there's no way I'm buying this for a friend or myself, that is homework. But this was a book that was recommended to me from Macklemore. I met him one time and I asked him like such a basic question because I was 18, I'm like, what's one book that changed your life? And he said, The Artist Way by Julia Cameron. I read this book and it reaffirmed that living a creative life is a life worth living. So if you guys want to pursue a creative lifestyle, this book will change your life. All right, another book for you, but this is more of like a journal. This is the five minute journal. You've probably heard of Tim Ferriss talking about this. I think it's pretty easy to be in a state where you kind of feel like frustrated by all the things that are going on in your life. And if you take a moment to say like, actually this is really good and this is really good and this happened in my day. Those quick moments, that five minutes, I think will have such an impact on the rest of your day. So this is the five minute journal. I love it. I don't use it all the time, but it is a great gift. Okay, moving on to one of the greatest products that came out this year. This is the Apple AirTag. I have four of these because I notoriously leave things behind. I had my camera bag stolen one time. <laughs> if I had this, I would have had my camera bag back. So get yourself 
a $30 air tag. All right, this next item comes in at around $40. If there's a sale, maybe you save a few bucks. This is the Moment tripod mount with MagSafe. The world is moving towards shooting on phones, both on photo and video. This is the easiest way to use your current tripod, connect it up and start shooting with your phone. You can shoot horizontal, you can shoot landscape. It's great and it's MagSafe, super easy to use and just slides into your backpack. This next item is the Ledger Hardware Crypto Wallet. And the reason why I like having a physical wallet for my crypto is because literally the first time I invested in Ethereum back in 2017, I invested in some bank called Quadriga. Then the guy that owned the bank died and I lost $1,000 worth of Ethereum, which would have been worth $5,000 today. So my storage now happens on this ledger right here. This is $59.99. This is where you should sort, this should be your bank where you store store all your crypto, and then you have a wallet like MetaMask where you keep a bit of money for your daily transactions. This is the best way to protect your crypto. All right, so if you've watched my office tour, you might've seen this next item. This is the analog to-do list. This is a bit pricey, but it actually works in my personal opinion. I'm the type of person where you get your little to-do list, you write down your main things to accomplish that day, and you keep it on your desk, and it's constantly reminding you that you are behind on the things that you're supposed to do. It's small, concise, and I actually check it off and get things done. The next item is the Peak Design Tech Pouch. This is the thing that goes into every single camera bag, comes on every single shoot because it holds all the essential items and all the tiny things that usually stop production from happening. Plus it accordions out and looks really good. All right, so this next item I am very excited about. It is not the camera, but the skin that goes on the camera. This right here is my custom skin design that I've been working on with cam skins for the last four months. We've been prototyping and this is the final design right here. I think it looks absolutely amazing. So they have a couple of different designs. You don't have to get my topographical map, but if you want to support this channel, I would highly appreciate it. This is a camera skin coming in at around $65. Part of the future of media is shooting things on your phone. That is how we consume content these days. Stabilizer is one of the cheapest and best tools to make your shots on your phone just look better. So my recommendation is the June Smooth Q3. It has a couple different features here. You tap this three times. You can go from vertical shooting all the way to horizontal shooting. And my favorite feature right here is it has a little fill light right here on the top. You just press that. Now you have a little fill light where you can change the brightness on and it spins around. Look, I'm at a conference. Hi, conference people. This is me making my conference video. Like and smash the subscribe button. Peace out. And then people are like, wow, that looks so good because he had a fill light. <laughs> All right, this next item is a bit pricier, coming in at around $115. This is a handmade leather camera strap. The craftsmanship on this is just absolutely incredible. Look at some of that stitching that you got right there. This is made by Cleaver Supply Co. And it uses the Peak Design anchor clips here, so it is nice and easy to just quickly throw it on your camera. It patinas really nicely. It is super high quality leather. I love this. This is my go-to camera strap. You are going to love this next product so much. This is one of my favorite tools for our pet. Lizzie, please bring in the Evo. Here <laughs> this right here is a live streaming robot where you can check in on your cats, on your dogs. Lizzie, talk to, talk to them over there. Hi guys. Do you want to see my tricks? Awesome. It has a live stream. $120. You can use it for your pets or if a family member, <laughs> you can check on them from a low angle. No, no. All right, so for all the photographers in your life, get them a high quality memory card. This is my favorite because it is the lowest price point for the best results. I can use this with my Sony a7S III and shoot 4K 60 frames per second and 120 frames per second. This is my recommendation for cards and memory cards for any single camera. One of my favorite lights of all time is the Aperture MC light here. It is so tiny, it is lithium ion battery. You can change the color on it. You can go into different saturation, but the footprint of this is just absolutely incredible. We are using two of these right now to light the background. <laughs> Whoa! 
Nope. All right, the next product is the Apple AirPods. I know they just released the three. These are the two, but this is one of my favorite products from Apple ever. It has the noise cancellation built into it that works so well. You can literally be on an airplane, turn them on and you can just go to snoozy time. I'm so excited for this next one. It's so stupid, but it's my favorite product in our entire lineup of filmmaking gear. You're gonna be like, what is it? Is it a camera? Whoa, tell me what it is. A stand. And you're like, why is the stand so special? Let me show you. The legs go out like a normal stand. You're like, cool, boring, move on. What's gonna happen? Oh, okay, that seems like a stand. Then you press the button. Oh, and it's a boom pole. What? So this is the Manfrotto, what is it, 420B or something? What is it here? The, the names change all the time, Manfrotto. I'll link the one that it is now and currently in the description below. For all the aspiring YouTubers or filmmakers in your life, you wanna make sure that they have a good key light. This is my recommendation. This is the Amaran 100D from Aperture. This is all you need to basically have some sort of talking head set up right here. And it is $200, so good. Aperture makes great products. Highly recommend this as your first key light. All right, so we're gonna move on to a few recommendations for camera bags. If there's a photographer, filmmaker in your life, a good camera bag is worth every penny. So the Low Pro AW series here, this is the 450. This is my go-to when I am traveling. So I have a different bag that I use when I'm just going out and shooting some photos, but when I need to store a bunch of stuff, we're talking multiple lenses, drones. This is like my favorite camera bag. Now, most creative people pursue a few different creative outlets, one of my outlets being music. So this is a guitar amp and Bluetooth speaker. This is the Spark from Positive Grid. It sounds so good and also it has an app where you can literally change all the different pedals that you want and get multiple different tones out of this. Like you have a crazy custom pedal board. So if you're into that kind of stuff, it's amazing. We also use it as a Bluetooth speaker in the office for its price point. This, this is amazing. Okay, the next thing is the Samsung T5 and T7 SSDs. You can work off of this. You can connect it with Premiere Pro and literally just edit directly off of this hard drive. I I highly recommend that if you don't have an SSD, start using one now. Okay, so as we move more towards mobile photography being a thing, like I shoot so many photos on my phone and obviously the best way to get unique shots is to have more lighting options available to you. So if you like that like American apparel type of like high light type of shots, this next product is for you. This is the Pro Photo C1 Plus. They also make the C1, so the plus is just like a little bit brighter. It instantly connects and you can just start taking like flash photos. It's a great way to get unique lighting with a phone. All right, if there's somebody in your life that doesn't have noise canceling headphones, this is just one of the best products of all time. They're expensive. This comes in at around $350, but they are worth every single penny because the noise cancellation is so freaking good. These are the Sony WH-100 Mark IV. Now this is the Mark III. If you can find the Mark III, it's slightly cheaper, but the Mark IV is the latest version. Why I love these is, it's so quiet right now. You can get your work done. It's the best way to start concentrating, stay in the creative space and stay in your creative flow state. But also it's an outside signifier to other people to leave you alone to get your work done. All right, so that is the holiday gift guide. If you need any links to anything, they will be in the description. And we are gonna close out on a cat outro because do you wanna see the gift that I got Lizzie last year? This is our Scottish Fold baby bear. I won Christmas last year. <laughs> yeah. We thought you were a boy. Turns <laughs> out she was a girl. Ever. I do love that cat. A lot. If you like this video, please press like. It actually makes a difference. Subscribe and hit the bell to be notified for future videos. Catch you guys in the next one. Love you. Love you. Love y'all. Bear says we love you. Bye. <laughs>